Hi, my name is Mark Winchester and I'm the Deputy District Director of the United States Small Business Administration Houston District Office. Before I begin to speak about the Economic Injury Disaster Loan Program, I just, I need to say thank you. I need to say thank you to uh, Mr. Kevin Shea, Ms. Lucy Liu, uh, Mr. Patrick Chen, and also City Council Member Ms. Alice Chen for organizing uh, this um, presentation, interview, so that those in the Chinese community, those business owners in the Chinese, Chinese uh, business community can know about the United States Small Business Administration and the resources that we have in response to uh, COVID-19. I now would like to turn it over to Council, City Council Member Ms. Alice Chen. Deputy Director Mark Winchester Lambang 已经通过了三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三三
还有就是妇女商业中心都会提供免费的咨询。This is the contact information for our three partners: the SBDC, Houston Score, Women's Business Center, and for the SBA. You'll want to visit our website, www.sba.gov/tx/houston, and once there, you'll want to sign up for email updates and also follow us on Twitter. 这这这个地方就是讲到怎么样联系这些免费的咨询。第一个就是小型企业发展中心他们的电话跟他们的 website。第二个就是修顺的 score 他们的电话跟他们的网站。第三个就是妇女商业中心他们的电话跟他们的 website。还有最重要就是美国小型企业的管理管理局，他们有他们的 website。刚刚提到是 www.sba.gov/taxes/tx。Forward slash Houston, can follow them on Twitter, and have their phone number. You can also call them. And now I would like to discuss financial assistance from the United States Small Business Administration. We are now starting to discuss from the United States SBA financial assistance. The CARES Act. The CARES Act was signed March 27, 2020. SBA policy regarding CARES Act was issued late April 2nd. You can read the act.、Uh, we cannot offer legal interpretation. We cannot comment on portions of the act unrelated to SBA. And the complete CARES Act is located at Congress.gov. Go to Bill, then 116th Congress, and then Bill 748. 刚刚提到了冠状病毒。爆发已经严重了，美国许多的小型企业，为了阻止为了阻止那个病病毒的传播，州政府和地方政府都命令关闭所有的 business 小型企业，导致小型企业呢，他们的销售额急剧下降，同时面临了进退两难的情况，就是到底是裁员还是继续支付工资。在这个情况之下，川普总统在三月二十七号签署了国会制定的。冠状病毒援助救济跟经济安全法案，我们叫 CARES（C A R E S） 法案。我们小型企业不能够任您做任何的咨询，但是大家可以上网去查一下你需要的资料。The CARES Act itself has sections, and these sections include the Paycheck Protection Program. And also the emergency economic injury disaster loan grant. 刚刚讲到的 CARES Act 通过的 CARES Act 是在两个 section， 大家可以上去查一下他们的需要跟规则。第一个是 section one one o two， 叫做 Paycheck Protection Program。另外一个就是 Emergency Idle Program。我们今天就是讲 Idle Program。I do want the audience to know that there is SBA debt relief, and that includes several things. One, the、uh, if you currently have an SBA loan, you can ask for deferment up to six months on that SBA loan. If it's a disaster loan, it is a deferment up to twelve months. 我让他知道，除了我们这个小型贷款之后，如果你现在已经有 Seven A, four O five, 这些弄的话呢，政府会帮你付六个月的本金利息跟费用。如果你有，呃，就是存在的这种灾难性的这个贷款的话，这个 SBA 会将你付到，帮你付款付到十二月三十一号，二零二零年。Under the CARES Act, there are two loan programs. There's the Paycheck Protection Program and the Economic Injury Disaster Loan. The one that we're going to talk about today is the Economic Injury Disaster Loan Program. 刚刚提到了这个 CARES 法案，政府给了两个贷款的选择。第一个就是薪资保护计划，英文叫 PPP。第二个叫做经济伤害灾难贷款。叫做 IDL，E I D L。我们今天就是要
专门讲这个 EID 哦。One other thing that I want to share about this slide, and that under the Economic Injury Disaster Loan, this is a loan that you get directly from SBA by applying online. 我特别要强调就是，这个 IDO loan 呢，是完全是网上申请的，那适合于 SBA 小型企业的标准，而且雇员不超过五百名。这个 loan 呢是上网申请。呃，而且是 SBA 可以直接通过核准。I do want to let the audience know that in addition to small businesses, nonprofits and faith-based organizations can also apply for the economic injury disaster loan. 我让大家知道，除了小型企业之外，还有就是信仰组织，包括教堂，包括宗宗宗教的庙。都可以有资料、有资格申请这个 PPP 跟 IDO loan 相关的资料呢。相关机构只要符合五零一 C three five zero one C three 的要求，如果有问题可以上网查询，到底是不是符合这个条件。In addition to faith-based and non-profits, SBA has now expanded to permit farm and ranches to apply for the Uh, economic injury disaster loan. 除了刚刚说小型企业跟教堂跟宗教团体之外，还有就是农场、牧场，只要是五百人以下的雇员，只要是能够符合他们收入的规则规规则，平均收入在一百万之内，就可以申请这个农业跟牧场都可以申请这个 loan. Now I would like to discuss the economic injury disaster loan program. 我们今天最主要就是要就要讨论这个 EIDL， 叫做 IDL loan 怎么申请？因为这个是每一个申请人可以上网申请，不需要靠银行或是呃其他的方式能够申请到这个 loan. The economic injury disaster loan program. It is a loan program up to two million dollars, no payments for twelve months. This economic injury disaster loan is called IDO. I now call it IDO. Its loan is not able to exceed two hundred thousand dollars, and it is not required to pay for twelve months. The interest rate on the IDO loan is three point seven five percent for small business, two point seven five percent for private nonprofits. 小型企业的利率是三点七五，非营利事业组织是二点七五。Repayment is up to thirty years. 贷款的偿还期可以长达三十年，但是它没有所谓的提早偿还的贷罚款。Eligible businesses include small businesses, small ag cooperatives, and private nonprofits. 符合条件的有小型企业、小型的农业合作社跟非营利组织都可以来申请。What it can be used for is fixed debts, payroll, accounts payable, and other bills affected by disaster. 可以用在固定的支出或者是债务，用在员工薪资、应付账款以及其他灾难影响而无法负担的账单。金额会反映到你未来六个月的营运的所需要的资金，所以这方面如果批准的话，就可以拿到这个 loan. The IDO loan may be approved solely on the applicant credit score. IDO loan 可以根据你的信用评分，有可能可以获得批准。Additional IDO details. 其他 IDO 的详细。There is no cost to apply, no obligation to take the loan if offered. 你不需要付任何的费用，而且如果就算批准之后，你也不需要接受这个 loan. Amount is determined by SBA from the information you provide. 这个贷款额呢是由 SBA 来做决定，是根据你的填表资料来做决定你的贷款额。Existing SBA disaster or business loan 
does not make you ineligible to apply for the economic injury disaster loan. 如果你已经有了 SBA 的那个灾难贷款，不会影响你这次的申请资格。Personal guarantee requirements. 个人担保的要求。There is no personal guarantee if the loan is under two hundred thousand. 如果贷款低于二十万美元的话，没有任何的个人担保要求。If the loan is two hundred thousand or above, then the guarantee from all individuals with an interest of twenty percent or more in the business must personally guarantee the loan. 如果贷款超过二十万，这个企业的百分之二十五股份的所有人都会连带的要提供保证。Collateral， 抵押品。If over twenty-five thousand, the idle loan requires collateral, also known as asset. 如果超过两万五千块 ，idle loan 需要你的抵押。SBA will not decline for lack of collateral, but requires the pledge of what is available. SBA 可能不需要你完全的做抵押品，而拒绝你的 loan， 但是呢。需要尽可能找到你的抵押品。CARES Act Idle Grant, also known as the CARES Act Idle Advance. 如何申请 idle loan 的奖金 ？This grant or advance is available until December 31st, 2020, for affected small businesses. May request this idle grant. This loan 呢是专门给小型企业，一直可以申请到十二月三十一号，二零二零年，最高的奖金可以达到一万块钱。然后这个 loan， 然后这个奖金就可以不用不用付付呃付偿还。The idle grant is up to ten thousand dollars. It is not automatic. It is up to ten thousand dollars. It is based on the calculation one thousand dollars per employee up to ten thousand dollars. This idle loan, 刚刚提到是不用偿还，但是条件是必须照看你的员工数人数。在一月三十一号，二零二零年，你的员工人数如果是十个人的话，就可以拿到最高额一万块。如果你的员工就是一个人的话，只能拿一千块。根据员工的人数，每一个员工可以。呃，符合一万一千块钱的这个免费的奖金。Payment should occur within three days. 他批准，照理说应该三天之内就可以批准。Repayment is not required if subsequently denied the idle loan. 如果你申请 idle loan 被拒绝，这个钱还是会给你做免费的奖金。The idle advance may be used for any purpose described in Section 15 U.S.C. 636 B.2, Section 7B.2. 这个钱呢，一定要用在所谓的呃，它的法规条例是十五 U.S.C. 六三六 B.2 的情况来付这个钱。The advance can be used for paid employee sick leave. 这个钱可以拿来付给员工的病假、病假资金。Payroll to retain employees， 保留你员工的薪水。Increased cost to obtain materials unavailable due to interrupted supply chains。你因为这个收不到你的那个呃供应量而损失的钱，都可以包括在里面。Rent or mortgage payments. The 租金或者你的贷款 Obligations that cannot be met due to revenue losses. 很多情况因为这个病毒的关系影响你的收入有损失 An applicant may receive an idle loan and a PPP loan as long as the costs being paid with each are different. No double dipping. This point is very important. The applicant can also apply for idle loan and PPP loan. But if you get the idle loan, you 
，又申请到 P P P loan， 就必须要选在 P P loan 呃 P P P loan 中减去这个收到的 idle loan， 不能够同时用在同一个项目上。How to apply for the economic injury disaster loan? 如何申请 idle loan? For the COVID-19 disaster, everything is online. 这个救灾的这个贷款全部都是网上申请 So the online application it works with iPhone with Safari and with Chrome on Android. 你可以在 iPhone 上面和 Safari。和 Chrome 一起在 Android 上面进行。If you have a PC, it works best with Internet Explorer or Microsoft Edge. 如果你是用 PC 的话，最适合是 Internet Explorer 或是 Microsoft Edge。The website to apply for the idle loan is www.sba.gov/disaster. 申请的网站是 www. dot s b a dot g o v forward slash d i s a s t e r. You may also contact the S B A Disaster Customer Service at eight hundred six five nine two nine five five. 你也可以打电话他们的灾难客服中心，电话是一八零零六五九二九五五。And email at disastercustomerservice at sba dot gov. 或者是用 email 的方式 at sba dot gov. 我刚刚试过那个电话，它的开放时间是礼拜一到礼拜天，休整时间早上七点到晚上七点都开放这个客服中心的电话。And for the hearing impaired, eight hundred eight seven seven eight three three nine. 如果听力有问题，可以打八零零。八七七八三三九。SBA has streamlined the application for the economic injury disaster loan. It is known as the disaster loan assistance page, and this streamlined process includes five steps: disclosures, business information, business owner information, additional information. And summary. This loan has five steps. On the SBA website, there are five steps. The first step is to confirm the information. The second step is to confirm the information. The third step is to confirm the information. The fourth step is to confirm the information. The fifth step is to summarize. Eligible entity verification. When you're applying for the economic injury uh, disaster loan on the disaster loan assistance page, you're going to choose one. Applicant is a business with not more than 500 employees. 在第一步确认资格这个部分，要求咨询是决定你适合符合这个经济受损灾难的资格。第一条是申请人必须是小于五百员工的公司。The individual business could also be a sole proprietorship or independent contractor. 申请人可以是个体经营，有没有雇员都无所谓，而且也是也可以做是也可以适合于独立承包商的个人。Applicant is a cooperative with not more than 500 employees. 申请人可以是合作社，员工不超过五百人。Employee stock ownership plan. 员工参股计划少于五百人的企业。Small business tribal concern. 这个是部落企业少于五百人的企业。Applicant is a business including agriculture cooperative, aqua uh, aquaculture enterprise, nursery, produce cooperative that meets the SBA style standard, but it's also my understanding that it now includes farmers. 申请人可以是农业的合作社、水产养殖企业，也包括农场跟牧场。Applicant is a business with more than 500 employees that is small under SBA size standards. 如果企业超过五百人员工，但是还是符合 SBA 查查核的时候，还是可以申请这个 loan. 
applicant is a private nonprofit that is a non-governmental agency or entity that currently has an effective ruling from the IRS and can include 501c, D, or E. 有国税局证明的非营利事业，或是州政府证明的非营利事业，或者是宗教团体没有收入的组织，只要符合 IRS Code 501c, D, and E 都可以申请。Review and check all of the following. 大家把画面下面这几条都要看过，而且要打勾。Applicant is not engaged in illegal activity. 申请人没有从事任何的非法行业。No principal of the applicant with a 50% or greater ownership interest is more than 60 days delinquent on child support obligation. 企业的合伙人超过百分之五十的合伙人，没有在子女抚养义务上有超过六十天没有付款的情况。Applicant is not an agricultural enterprise other than agriculture enterprise cooperative or nursery. 申请人，呃，不是农业，不是农业的经营。Applicant does not present live performances of a purulent sexual nature. 申请人不是色情的行业。Applicant does not derive more than one third of gross annual revenue from a legal gambling activity. 申请人的赌博收入不能够超过总收入的三分之一。Applicant is not in the business of lobbying. 申请人不是游游说的企业。Applicant cannot be a state. Local or municipal government entity, and cannot be a member of Congress. 申请人不能够是州或地方政府的机构，或者是国会议员。Business information. 商业咨询。This includes business legal name. 填写公司的注册名称，就是法定名称。Trade name, 商业名称 could be EIN or SSN for sole proprietorship. 报税的号码 organizational type, 公司的类型 status on nonprofit, 公司是不是非营利企业 franchise, 公司是不是连锁企业 gross revenues for the last twelve months prior to the disaster, January thirty first, twenty twenty. 在二零二零一月三十一号以前，倒算回去的十二月的总收入。Cost of goods sold for the same period. 二零二零年一月三十一号倒算去回去十二个月所有的卖卖货的成本。For rental properties, you may be a business owner who owns rental properties. You can submit lost revenues due to the disaster. Both for residential and commercial. 如果你是房东的话，你可以因为疫情而损失的租金可以报上去，包括这个商业或者是家庭住宅的房东都可以报上去。It can also include if you're a nonprofit, nonprofit cost of operation for the previous twelve months prior to January thirty first, twenty twenty. 宗教团体可以在也是可以把一月三十一号二零二零以前倒算去十二个月的运作支出报上去。If you're a faith-based organization, that in, could include combined annual operating expenses for the previous twelve months, as long as you can demonstrate that it's for all secular social services. 宗教团体必须要提供社会服务，才能够有资格申请。And then you want to, for the faith-based organization, list the secular social services provided. One more time. Uh, you then want to list the secular social services provided by the faith-based entity. Okay, 宗教团体必须要列出来，他们为这个社会社区做了哪些的服务。You also want to report when applying for the economic injury disaster loan all sources of compensation 
that arise from the disaster itself. You then you want to provide a brief description of the compensation. Primary business address. 公司地址, including city, state, county, uh, zip code. 公司地址, 公司的城市, 哪一州, 还有地区号, business phone, alternative business phone. 这边很重要是, 两个电话, 一个是公司电话, 一个是备用电话, 可以把手机放上去, Business fax, business email. 电传地址, 跟邮地, 呃, email的地址. Date business was established. 公司哪一天成立? Current ownership. 申请人, 得到这个企业从哪天开始, 譬如说你买别人的事业, 从那一天,你是拥有这个企业,从那一天开始. Business activity. 服务的类型, 餐厅还是美容院? Detailed business activity. 你的业务是什么? Number of employees. It is critical, it is very critical, that you list the complete number of employees that are working for you, because this will impact uh, uh, your eligibility on the uh, dollar amount, both for idle and the idle advance. This is I also need to emphasize every section that is highlighted in red, every section that has an asterisk, you need to complete that section. And when you do complete that section, it will turn green. And then when you have the page completely green and everything entered, then you can click next. 它每一个页都有一个你填的那个表之后，本来是红色的呃线，你填完之后就变成绿色的线。每一页的申请表都要填完才能够到下面一个步骤，这是非常重要的，而且要填到真实的数字。Owner information. 第三步，业主的资讯。This includes. Is the business owned by a business entity? Please make sure to check off either yes or no. You make sure this企业主是不是拥有这个企业? Individual owner slash agents. 个人所有权的资料. Please provide all contact information, including first name, last name, mobile phone, title, uh, ownership, email, SSN, and all additional information including place of birth and U.S. citizenship. You also want to make sure that you include your residential information. Now, and uh, uh, Councilwoman Chen is making sure that uh, she's pointing this out, and that is for each owner that has an interest of 20% or more, they will need to be added on to this online application. If you're a sole proprietorship, independent contractor, it's just going to be you. But if you are a business where there are other owners who have an interest of 20% or more, they too are going to have to complete this owner information before you complete next or submit next. 
每一位百分之二十股份的人都要把企业的那个业个人的资讯填在这个旁边那个栏。填到百就是，如果说你独资企业，你就填你自己的；如果说你有合伙人的话，每一个合伙人超过百分之二十，都要列出他个人的资讯，才能够到下一步。Additional information: They're going to ask a series of questions, including any criminal offenses, debarred from doing business with the federal government, including. Uh, they also want to know if you've been indicted or other criminal information. 第四步是其他的咨询，这个部分是关于这个申请人在过去一年有没有犯罪记录，呃，所有人是不是呃被拒绝，被联邦政府的贷款被拒绝过，呃，还有包括是不是在过去六个月被逮捕过，有没有犯罪的历史记录？当然，这不包括开车被拿到罚单。If anyone assisted you in completing this app application, whether you pay for the service or not, that person must enter their information below. 如果有人帮你填写这个这个表格的话，你一定要把这个填写人的资料放在这上面，包括他的联络电话。Please make sure that you give permission to SBA to discuss any portion of the application with the representative listed above. 你要让 SBA 知道，这个填写人有资格帮你去提供所有的资料。So we've discussed the additional information page. There's a second additional information page that I'd like to discuss with you. 还有另外更多的资料，我想在这边跟你大家解释一下。Under this page, if you want the idle events. You need to select. I would like to be considered for the advance up to ten thousand dollars. It is not automatically ten thousand. And to remind you, the calculation is one thousand dollars per employee, up to ten employees for the ten thousand dollars. 这个地方非常重要。这一页上面看到 ，I would like to be considered for advance up to ten thousand dollars. 这就是我刚刚讲的。这个部分呢是根据你在一月三十一号二零二零年当天的员工人数来做决定。如果你有员工一个人，他补助一千块；如果有十个人补助一万块，超过就是最高只能只能拿到一万块。这个地方一定要打个 check mark， 不打 check mark 他不会考虑。You also need to include bank name, account number, routing number. 你必须要把那个你提供你的银行的名字、银行的账号跟银行的代号。才可以把钱直接打到你的账上。And then you also need to certify under penalty of perjury under the laws of the United States that the above is true and correct. 你必须要在这页填填填一个我证实所陈述的所有的申请资料是正确正确的资料。如果有有错误或是故意填写错误，会有法律的责任。After applying, 在你申请完之后 loan processing decision, 处贷款处理的决策 information is verified, credit checked. You may be also to provide. You may be asked to provide additional information. SBA 的专员在收到你的申请文件之后，会查核所有的资料。如果他们需要更多资料，他们会跟你打电话联络。The economic injury disaster loan amount is determined. 贷款结构，并且怎么样去拿到资金。A loan officer contacts you, makes recommendations. 一旦核准的话，会有专员跟你联络。I cannot emphasize enough the idle advance. SBA is supposed to fund you the idle advance in three days. The decision regarding the idle application itself normally takes up to four weeks. 我必须要强调，刚刚讲的一万块最大最高达一万块的奖金是必须在很快的时间三天之内给你提供，但是这个不不影响你的这个 loan 会被核准或者不不核准。Finally, I'd like to talk about loan closes and funds dispersed. 我要让大家知道怎么样去拿到这个 loan. 
Once you are approved for the idle economic injury disaster loan, you will sign documents, you will submit the loan documents. 一旦被核准通过的这个贷款，你必须要填写贷款的文件，并且签字。The initial disbursement of twenty-five thousand dollars. 在前面的两万五千块。This does not include the up to ten thousand dollar advance. And this initial disbursement of twenty-five thousand is within five days after the loan closing. This good news is that if you are approved, the first five thousand dollars is immediately put in your account within five days. This does not include the ten thousand dollars advance. When the loan closes and the funds are dispersed, you will also have a case manager assigned. That will help you with the rest. 一旦这个贷款被核准 ，SBA 的专员会安排所有的其他的帮助。This concludes the idle loan program. I want to thank again、uh, Kevin Shea, Lucy Liu,、uh, Mr. Patrick Chen, and also City Council Member、uh, Ms. Alice Chen. On behalf Of the SBA, the Houston District Office, and Mr. Tim Jeffcoat. This is Mark Winchester. Thank you for your time. 在最后一节，我跟大家讲一下，各位华人朋友，你可以申请两样的这个呃这个贷款。PPP 是工资保障计划，也就是说，向银行就是联络 SBA 核准的银行去申请。这个 loan 呢，事实上是只有八个礼拜的。薪资的帮助，但是 idle idle 这个 loan 是经济受损灾难这个贷款呢，是全部上网申请，是由 SBA 核准的。所以呢，大家记得在 download 的时候，你最好把那个他的那个 online 的那个 form 都先呃把它看过以后，填上正确的资料，因为一旦不填上正确资料的话，就很麻烦，而且会拖延你的审核时间。申请之后呢，你可以。呃，你只要两边的弄都拿了，因为 PPP 的 interest 是百分之一，就是一个 percent。这个 idle loan 的它的 interest 是三点七五，所以各位朋友，因为这个 loan 需要很多啊四个礼拜以上的时间，所以你可以两边都申请，看哪一个 loan 先拿到，你再做决定要拿哪一个 loan。而且不要忘记了，这个 loan 都不要续任何的手续费，呃，而且是一年以后才要偿还，所以大家一定要把握时间。刚刚提到了这个 loan 是有限额的，越快申请越好。所以我在呼吁所有的朋友们，大家一定要抓紧时间，赶快去上网申请这个政府补助金，呃，来帮助大家度过难关。我我还要讲的就是，刚刚那个 Mark Winchester 的所有的 presentation， 不光是今天的，他曾经到我们的 Stafford 市市政府录下所有的。这个 SBA 的申请方法包括 PPP 跟 SBA， 呃，跟那个 Idle Loan， 大家可以上网去看他的录影。他是 www. stafford s t a f f o r d t x. g o v。上去之后可以看到我们的 Mark Winchester 用英文把全部的 SBA 的 PPP 跟 Idle Loan 做一步一步一步的解释。今天我们用中文是因为。大家 idle loan 可以上网申请，我们刚刚已经一步一步跟大家讲解释怎么样申请。但是 PPP 是必须要经过银行的，所以各位朋友在这个时候把握机会，赶快去申请，能够顺利成功拿到这个政府的补助跟低息的贷款。我要感谢《世界日报》的，呃，《世界日报》跟呃红媒媒体的谢谢木顺先生跟呃卢淑君小姐。今天特别义务来帮忙录这个影，大家可以随时的去查看每一步的解说。记得了，在做网上的时候要 make sure 每一步都能够做对。如果看不清楚，再重新看过一个，知道你把全部的东西填上之后 ，submit 之后，你就可以等待这个资资金可能会很快的会通过。在这里祝福大家顺利成功，能够申请到补助金。我也希望这次的录影能够对大家有所帮助。谢谢大家。